Hello, my friend. Welcome to your practice. My name is Roya, and today we have a nice, grounding, compact, simple practice that we're going to use to kind of allow the movement to settle down to the bottom and ground ourselves, come back home to ourselves. And yeah, it's going to be nice, simple, juicy, and we'll get right into it. We're going to start standing at the top of our mat in a Tadasana pose, pressing down through all four corners of your feet. And then, nice and simple, relax your shoulders down, open your palms facing forward, and just stand here, right off the bat. As you stand and land into your practice, notice your posture. Are you hunching down, your shoulders rolling forward? Can you gently roll them back? Maybe gently rising your chin and lengthening out of your waist, growing tall from your feet all the way up to your crown. What does your environment feel like? Is there any background noise? Is it silent? Can you begin to embody your breath on however it feels today, however fast, slow, deep, shallow it is, can you just step into your body? And the next breath in, we'll begin to activate through our fingertips, reach your fingers nice and tall. High mountain, feel this opening in your chest, in your spine. And then exhale, palms connect at your heart center. Feel the warmth of one palm pressing against the other. Draw your palms in. Inhale, interlace your last three fingers, your index and your thumb point up. We reach our palms up towards the sky. Take a breath in as you grow tall. Exhale, bump your hips towards the left, bend over towards the right. In a little banana shape, feel this opening across the left side of your body. Gently press your left shoulder back, right shoulder forward. Inhale, come towards center, nice and tall. Exhale, we go towards the opposite direction. This time, left shoulder forward, right shoulder back. Inhale, rise up. Exhale, your arms fall by your side. Melt your chest into your thighs. Take a forward fold. On your exhale, see if you can organically allow your chest to fall a little bit closer towards the ground. We lift up halfway. Fingers slide up your shins. Can you gently press your palms into your shins and roll your shoulders back to create a straight spine? Feel the subtle sensations. And then exhale, melt back down. Grabbing a hold of your opposite elbows. You can invite a gentle bend into your knees if you want to go a little bit into your lower back. Taking this ragdoll fold, playing with your balance as you shift your weight into different corners of your feet. Relax your neck. Notice if you're holding any tension there. Shake your head yes. Shake your head no. Whatever feels good for you right now. Nice and loose quality throughout your body. And then we'll gently release the grip of our elbows. Rise up halfway one more time. Exhale, plant your palms down. Step back into your first downward facing dog. Your heels press down towards the ground. Pressing into your palms. Your chest goes closer towards your thighs. Inhale. Exhale, relax your head, your neck. Press down through your palms and your fingers. Inhale, shift your weight forward. Come into a high plank. Pause. You press away from the earth. Inhale. Exhale, drop down onto your knees. Let your belly drop down with your knees. Open your chest. Come into a cow pose. Inhale. Exhale, press the ground away. Tuck your tailbone in and around your spine. Cat spine. And again, inhale, open. Nice and juicy as you draw your chest towards your shoulder. Exhale, press the earth away, round your spine. Continue just like that, moving at your own pace with your own breath, how it feels today in your body. 
If this feels too rigid for you, let loose a little bit. Ooh, did you hear that crack? Create some circles with your hips, bending into your elbows, maybe include your neck. As if you're moving through a thick substance like honey, can you make this as intentional while trusting where your body wants to go? And then if you're making circles in one direction, reverse the direction. Oof. Moving with the wave of your breath. And then exhale, come back towards center. Shift your weight forward. Untuck your toes, open your chest, take a breath in. Exhale, using the strength of your arms, your elbows hugging towards your side, gently draw your chest all the way down to the ground. Fingertips come to the top edge of your mat. We gently press into them, rolling your heart open, rolling your shoulders back. Your face is the last thing to lift towards the sky. Exhale, melt down. One more time, inhale, press through your fingers, levitating your chest up, heart open, breathe in. Exhale, melt down. Inhale, palms underneath your chest, rise up, shift your weight back, downward facing dog. Inhale, we begin to reach our right leg up towards the sky, three-legged dog. Exhale, draw your knee in towards your nose, press away from your palms, Hover your knee off of your mat. Inhale, lift your leg nice and high. Exhale, draw your knee in. Landing your knee down to the center of your mat, we open towards the left side so your right palm stays planted. Left fingers reach nice and high. Take an inhale. On your exhale, imagine that there's something that you want to the right side of your mat. You're going to thread your left palm through your right armpit and reach towards the right side of your mat, taking this little twisty sensation through our spine. And again, inhale, open. Your legs stay in the same shape. Exhale, right palm stays planted. You can gently bend into your right elbow if that feels more comfortable, reach underneath your armpit. Inhale, reach your arm nice and tall. Exhale, we rise out of our right palm. Left palm comes onto your left shin. Right fingers reach nice and tall. Take an inhale. Rolling your right shoulder back. Exhale, cartwheel your arms down. Frame off your right knee. Tucking your left toes, right leg rises up towards the sky, three-legged dog. Exhale, draw your knee in. Lightly land your foot in between your palms. You can ground through your left knee. Untuck your left toes if that feels more comfortable or stay lifted. We rise up into our low or our high lunge. Take an inhale. Exhale, sink down. <sighs> Relax your shoulders. And again, inhale. Exhale, begin to wrap your right arm underneath your left. Give yourself a big hug. Wrapping your palms around your shoulder. Take a breath in. And then exhale, feeling the warmth of your palms around your shoulders. Tilt down. Tapping your right elbow onto your right knee. Inhale, rise. Feeling less strength in your legs. Exhale, tap. Inhale, rise. Reach your arms up this time. Exhale, open up into a warrior two, sinking nice and low. Inhale, lean forward. Flip your front palm. Take a reverse warrior, reaching up and back. Exhale, extended side angle, front arm onto your front thigh, or you can drop your fingertips all the way down. Left fingers reach towards the top of our mat. Inhale, keep your legs in the same shape. Reverse warrior, one more time. Exhale, draw your right toe to face inward, both toes slightly inward. Take a wide-legged fold, melting your heart towards the ground, pressing your palms into the earth. Inhale, hover your chest so it's parallel to the ground, halfway lift. Exhale, crawl your palms to face the back of your mat. Take a breath in, in your low lunge, framing off your left foot. And then exhale, ground your right knee, walk your palms back and flex your left toes up towards the sky, finding a half split. Take a breath in. 
Exhale, whatever tension you might feel, just relax into it. Deepen your breath in the posture as you go into your left hamstring. Inhale, come forward into your low lunge. Plant your right palm down, left fingers reach up towards the sky. Take an easy twist. And then exhale, plant your left palm inside of your left foot. Crawl your palms back into that wide-legged fold. This time, draw your heels in, toes out. We come into our goddess pose. So you rise up, sinking nice and low into your hips. Finding a straight spine, active and engaged at the same time in our posture. Embracing the strength while also embracing the gentle stretch, maybe not so gentle. Depends on how you're feeling today. Press through your feet, inhale, rise, come up into a five-pointed star. Exhale, pivot onto your left toes, come back into your high lunge, facing the top of your mat, one breath in. Exhale, plant your palms to frame off your right foot. Step back into your high plank, inhale. Exhale, you can drop down onto your knees. Your elbows hug in towards your side. Drop your chest all the way down. Inhale, take a baby cobra using just your back strength or press into your palms, lifting your heart, breathe in. Exhale, tuck your toes downward facing dog. Inhale, rise, bunch your toes. Bend your knees, step or hop to the top of your mat. Coming into your forward fold, we rise up halfway, feeling your fingers tickle your shins. And then exhale, melt your heart down. Inhale, press into your feet as you bend your knees. As you grow tall, reaching your fingertips up towards the sky, breathe in. Exhale, nice and safe in your body, palms connect at your heart. Interlace your last three fingers, index and thumb point up. We do the same thing as before. Inhale, reach your fingers high. Exhale, bend over towards the right in a banana shape. Inhale, come towards center. Exhale, opposite side. Your fingers and their grip are supporting you. Inhale, rise up. Exhale, arms fall by your side. Take a forward fold. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, plant your palms down, step back into your downward facing dog. Inhale, left toes lift up towards the sky. Exhale, guide your knee in towards your chest, pause and hover. Inhale, three-legged dog. Exhale, draw your knee in, engage through your core, pause for a moment. And then exhale, we lightly land our left knee down, opening our body towards the right. We stay rooted through our left palm, right fingers reach up towards the sky. Take an inhale. And then exhale, we thread the needle, drawing our right fingers underneath our left arm. Maybe we bend into that left arm a little bit. It might feel a little bit awkward. Just embrace the, sens the sensation. Inhale, right fingers reach up. Exhale, one more time, thread that needle. Inhale, reach up nice and tall. Exhale, engaging through our core, we lift out of our left palm. Right palm comes onto our right shin, left fingers reach nice and long. And then exhale, cartwheel your arms down to frame off your left knee. We tuck our right toes, reach up, three-legged dog. Exhale, guide your knee in towards your chest, lightly land your foot in between your palms. Again, option for that back knee down or keep it hovering. Press through your foot, begin to rise up. Inhale. Exhale. Oh, relax into our high lunge. Relax into the depth of your breath. And then we'll begin to wrap our right arm over top of our left, finding our bear hug, bear squeeze. One breath in. Take a gentle back bend as your elbows face up. Exhale, the strength of your thighs support you as you tilt down and tap your elbow to your knee. Inhale, rise up. Your left foot nice and firm, grounded. Exhale, tap. Inhale, unwrap your arms, reach them up towards the sky, breathe in. 
exhale ground through your back heel open up into your warrior two sinking nice and low like a like a surfer trying to catch their balance palms face down and now flip your front palm take it up and back reverse warrior exhale taking your variation of extended side angle elbow to knee or fingers all the way down depending how deep you want to go today Inhale, rise up, reverse warrior. Exhale, left toes face inward, finding your wide-legged fold, melting your heart down. Maybe this time you want a shoulder stretch. Interlace your fingers behind your back and let your palms fall closer towards the ground behind you. And then gently release your fingers if you had a bind. Rise up halfway, pressing your palms down. Exhale, crawl your palms to face your right foot. Take a breath in, in your low lunge, opening your chest. And then exhale, grounding your left knee, flexing your right toes towards your face, finding this half split. Notice if your left hip is going backwards, can you gently press your left hip forward, right hip back. Take a breath in. Exhale, naturally melt down. Inhale, begin to come forward, framing off your right foot. Left palm comes down, right fingers reach up. You can lift that back knee too. Inhale. Exhale, your right palm lands to the inside of your right foot. Crawl your palms towards the center. This time your heels in, toes out, pressing through your feet as you grow tall into your goddess pose. Palms connect your heart space. Take a breath in. If you're pushing your butt out, gently press it in, maintaining the solid shape of your goddess pose. And then we'll press through our feet, rise up, high star. Exhale, pivot your back toes so they're facing forward. Come back into your high lunge facing the front. One breath in. Exhale, plant your palms to frame off your left foot. Step back into your high plank, inhale. Exhale, find your flow however you need to, making our way to the same place back in a downward facing dog. Tapping your toes, hips press back. Inhale, rise up onto your toes. Exhale, bend your knees, step or hop to the top of your mat. Inhale, halfway lift. Moving a little bit faster, breath to movement. Exhale, flow down. Inhale, bend into your feet, rise up. Reaching your fingertips up towards the sky, inhale. Exhale, palms connect at your heart center. This time we take a seat into our chair pose. Interlace your last three fingers, index fingers and thumb point up. Begin to rise. As you do, we shift our weight into our left foot. Guide your right knee in towards your chest. Flexing your right toes, take a breath in. Exhale, sink back down into your chair pose. Drop your right foot down. This time we shift our weight into our right foot. Left leg rises. Flex into your left foot. Exhale, drop it back down. Sit into your chair. These little marches. Inhale, draw your weight into your left foot. Right leg rises. Exhale, release the grip of your fingers. With control, we bend into our left knee. Begin to kick your right leg back into a flying warrior. Take a breath in. We're not here for long. Exhale, drop your right foot down. High lunge, one breath in. Exhale. Begin to draw your right arm over top of your left. Give yourself that bare squeeze, inhale. Light lean back, exhale, tap. Inhale, lift. Feel that energy in your thigh. Stay with it. Exhale, tap. Inhale, lift. Exhale, we shift our weight forward, drawing your right knee in towards your chest, and then maybe wrapping your right thigh around your left. If it's accessible, maybe your right toes wrap around your left ankle. Maybe you take full eagle arms, coming into our eagle pose, feeling the energy in your thighs and embracing it. Deepening your breath. If you wobble, that's okay. Just stay with it. Play with it. Take it lightly. Ah. 
Feeling the warmth of your body wrapped around itself. One more inhale. Exhale, slowly rise. We unwrap our legs, planting your right foot next to your left. Reach your arms nice and long. Exhale, palms connect, take a forward fold. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, plant your palms, step back into your high plank, inhale. Exhale, stay as you are, just drop your hips down, your chest stays lifted. Come into a hanging cobra, so your toes stay tucked. One breath in, maybe rock forward and back, just embracing this opening. Maybe leaning your head back for a gentle throat stretch. And then exhale, bending your knees, coming back into your downward facing dog. Rise up onto your toes, look between your palms. We step or hop our way there. Halfway lift. Exhale, melt your heart down. Lose yourself in the flow. Press through your feet, grow all the way up towards the sky. Palms connect. Exhale, sink low into your chair pose. Interlace your last three fingers. Shift your weight into your right foot. Left leg rises up towards the sky. Fingers point up. Maybe you look up for an extra challenge. Exhale, sink back down. Inhale, shift your weight to your left foot. Draw your right knee in towards your heart. Exhale, sink back down. Inhale, shift your weight to your right foot. Take a breath in. Exhale, release the grip of your fingers. With control, light bend into the right knee. Kick your left toes back. One inhale. Flying warrior, feel the confidence in the actual shape of the posture. Take a breath in. Exhale, lightly land your left toes down. Find a high lunge, inhale. Find your breath. And then exhale, wrap your left arm around your right. Give yourself that bear squeeze. Give yourself a little squeeze, inhale. Exhale, tap your elbow to your knee. Inhale, energize through your legs as you rise up. Exhale, one more time, tap. Inhale, lift up. Exhale, we shift our weight into our right foot. Flexing your left foot. Guiding our left knee in towards our heart. And then exhale, we bend into both knees, wrapping our, right, wrapping our left leg around our right. And then maybe the left toes around the right ankle. Take an inhale, maybe take full eagle arms, shifting your weight slightly back. So the weight is in our heel. And then lifting, lengthening through your spine. One inhale. And then exhale, slowly rise, left knee hugs in towards your heart, release your arms. Exhale, drop your left foot next to its mate. Right fingers reach up towards the sky, breathe in. Both fingers rise, exhale, forward fold. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, plant your palms, step back into your high plank, breathe in. Exhale, let your hips drop down, open your heart. You can untuck your toes, just find a cobra. And then exhale, make your way down. Draw your forearms out in front of you. Finding a sphinx pose so they're Parallel to each other, we open our heart. Gentle opener to our lower spine. And then exhale. We come down, press through your palms, shift your weight back, come into a child's pose, melting your heart towards your thighs, forehead towards your mat, and just softening into your body. After all that movement, just indulging in the stillness. And then we'll slowly crawl our palms back towards our knees. Inhale, reach your fingertips up towards the sky. Exhale, right fingers come to your left knee, open towards the left side. Gently pressing your right fingers into your knee. Rolling your left shoulder back. Inhale, rise up. Exhale, we go towards the opposite direction. Softening into your twists, making yourself as relaxed as possible through your exhale. 
And then inhale, rise up. Exhale. Taking a cross-legged seat. You're welcome to draw the soles of your feet together. We take one more breath in. Stay here or exhale, melt your heart down in a butterfly pose. Going into our inner hips and just notice the tension you might feel as you feel yourself softening into this physical tension. Can you maybe do the same mentally, energetically, whatever tension might be in your body that you might not be able to put your finger on? Can you just feel yourself easing and dissolving it away? without putting too much effort into that either. Take a deep breath in. And maybe with a gentle smile, let it go. We slowly rise up. Palms to your knees, maybe gently close your eyes and just soften here for a moment. Redirecting your breath towards your lower belly. Just feeling safe with yourself, patient with yourself, with everything that's going on around you, just coming home to this short moment of stillness and maybe carrying it with you throughout the rest of your day or your evening. Together we draw our palms in towards our heart, taking one last deep Juicy final breath. Inhale. Bring it all the way up to your crown. Hold. And then exhale. Let it go. Nice and simple. Thank you all for joining me for this practice and for making it all the way here. I hope you guys enjoyed and I hope you guys have an amazing, calm, still, simple rest of whatever time of day it is for you. From my heart to yours, lots of love. Mwah. Namaste.